Hey guys, it's me Rahul and let's check out some cool applications. The first application I have for you guys is called Odify Notification Reader. This application will let you know about a notification without even glancing at your phone. That's pretty cool, right? Mm, for some users. So basically what this app does is it actually reads out notification. It might be an unwanted feature for some of you, but I find this feature extremely helpful when I'm at home. At home, I don't usually carry my phone with me. Because this app reads out notification, I only have to pick up my phone when there is something important. The UI of this app is pretty clean and minimalistic. So on the main page, you have a couple of options like enable Audify on headset speaker. You also have option to mute annoying apps. It is actually a great application. So check it out. Moving on to the next application, it is called AmpMe. Basically, this app helps you to create a multi-speaker system by just using some phones. Although it sounds great, it is not that great. This app needs a solar high-speed internet connection to work properly. That is not good. I wish they had taken advantage of the Wi-Fi hotspot or the Wi-Fi direct to communicate with other devices. But there are some problems. First, it might not work properly when more than 10 people joins the party. Second, this app is cross-platform compatible. That means this app works with both iOS and Android devices. So there is a chance for some bugs and glitches. But if they somehow manage to use Wi-Fi hotspot for singing and sending the audio, that will be great. Other than that, there isn't much to say. To create a multi-speaker system, grab your phone, open the app, then create a party. Then choose the songs, then grab an another phone, join the party, then type in the party code and you are done. To sync the audio, follow the instructions. Yeah, that's basically it. It's a great application, but you need high speed internet connection to make it work. Next application I have for you guys is called Stab Social Photo Maps. This application will help you to discover and share beautiful places near you. This application is free to download in the Google Play Store. When you open up the application, you can see pictures that other users posted who is near you. You have a slider on the top to adjust the range. Moving on to the map section, here you can explore stabs. Basically some cool photos of cool locations. So in this case, I am interested in checking out some amazing places in Africa. So I will just zoom in, then tap on any of the stabs. And here I have a picture of wonderful waterfall. There is an option to pin this, you can also check out the user's profile and you can comment and all that good stuff. Also you can share cool photos of the locations near you. So yeah, a wonderful and free travel app. You guys should check it out. Fourth one I have for you guys is called Comic Chameleon. Using this application you can read a lot of web comics. I love to read comics so much. So this app will be on my phone for a long time. The UI of this app is simple and elegant. So check it out if you are a fan of reading comics. Next up, it's called Full Contact. This application will help you to store a ton of information about your contacts and it is cloud synced so you can access your contacts from any of your devices. It is actually a wonderful application that has a great potential. So go check it out. It is basically a fully fledged contacts application that is really, really good. Moving on, the next application is Pulsar Music Player. There is nothing special in this music player except the fact that the UI is material design. That is great and animations are cool too. So yeah, it plays music like just, just like any other music player and if you want to use equalizer, you have to pay some bucks. Next application is called XOF for Twitter. With this application, you can share a part of an article in picture format so your Twitter followers can read that long note. Also, you can highlight the parts you want. You can set the source and overall it does the job very well. Also you have different colors to choose from. Once you copy it and paste the tags, highlight the main portions of the note, choose the color and choose the source and then post it to Twitter. It's a great useful tool so check it out. Next application I have for you guys is called Swipe Bubble. Using this application you can launch an app or do any actions with a simple swipe up from the navigation bar. For example, I'm gonna set this app to open dialer whenever I swipe up. Now let's try it. Swipe up and here we go, dialer. It works perfectly fine. There are a lot of customization options and settings that you can change to make it the way you like. Overall, a must have application for Android. I really love this application. Next application is called Signal Private Messenger. 
So this app is of course a messenger app. But the servers in between you and the receiver has no access to your data or messages. The server will not store any data. So privacy is 100%. This app uses advanced end-to-end -end encryption protocol to send messages. And other than that, this app is pretty much like WhatsApp or any other messenger app. You can create groups but with 100% privacy. For me, that is the best future. So the last application I have for you guys is a wallpaper application. It is called Tapad. It consists one of the most beautiful wallpapers I have ever seen. So go check it out. And all the links, all the download links will be in the description down below. And I will see you guys again in my next video. Goodbye. Swear it's been 700 degrees in here since you came in I could swear that this room has been running out of air And now it's starting to spin